What's up, guys? It's King Daddy D Mac, and welcome! Welcome back to another episode of Ark Survival Evolved! That's right, we're playing here with Ark Supreme, having so much fun doing flips! My goodness, how's everybody doing today? Hope you're doing well, because me. I'm sitting kind of on top of the world. Yeah, we, last episode, battled the prime boss, which was a giant death worm, just like the one behind us. And we prevailed with the dire bear army. Yes, our horde of dire bears absolutely mopped the floor with them. Definitely go back and check it out if you missed it. But that means today we are actually able to, if we so choose, to move on to the next tiers of creatures. That is the elementals. We have fire, we have frost, and we have electric. It's kind of pricey moving on. So let's see what we can do. But guys, please remember if you're enjoying the series to show that amazing support. It helps me out oh so much by smashing that thumbs up button. And if you're new to the channel or you haven't yet, seriously, what are you waiting for? It is the perfect time to subscribe. Yes. Also, if you want to play along with us, remember we do have the member server for you YouTube members and Twitch subscribers. Both are welcome. Just remember with Twitch, if you have Amazon Prime in your family, you get a free sub every single month. That's right. So make sure to link the accounts. If you're not using it, you are in fact losing it. All right. So I did a little, little bit of remodeling in our little base. And uh, yeah, put a second row of stuff, not completely filled in yet. But yes, was able to move the fridges up, get extra volts in and kind of move over all of our hives because we have three new hives that we're going to have to put in for these new elementals. And yeah, moved all of this stuff over. So pretty dang cool. Let's carry on. Um, we need to make the special narcotics for each. We need to make what else? What else? Kibble for each. We need to get the honey going. So let's go ahead, grab each of the different bees. Frost, fire, and electric. Very nice. What's up, bees? How you doing? You want to be my friend? All right, let's go ahead, get these guys over here and a going. They're a little janky, I, I do have to say. A little janky. We'll, we'll make the best. We'll make do. All right. Let's get each of them, if we can, landed. Um, I know there was issues with the bees, like, disappearing and stuff. So I'm hoping that's not the case. Of course, if you have the hives, it's, you know, it's all set. Oh, my goodness. You know what? Every time when I mount and dismount the bees, I get kind of, like, stuck in the floor. It's really weird. All right. We better now? All right. Better. Let's just leave it like this. So let's go ahead. Throw in frost flowers boom into there we have with this one electric electric flowers into there and finally fire flowers awesome so for each of them we'll be able to make a hive with how many 15 if we so choose so we'll see how that works out. Each honey, though, is only one flower, so we should get 200 out of each. Now, of course, you may ask, DMAC, what is the honey for? Well, anyone that plays Supreme would know, but if you don't know, if you want to get the... Oh, am I looking in the wrong thing? Yes, I am. Hold the phone, hold the phone. If I want to get the kibble for any of them, we need honey. So... That's being done. Now, we already have the elemental bone meal, so that's cool. That's not a problem. And then, let me see. And then, how are we doing it for all of our bloods for each of them? So, it looks like we're lowest on electric. So, just good to take note. Electric's going to be the hardest for us to move on with. But as far as uh, fire, frost, we're sitting pretty. We're doing pretty good here. Now, the next issue is we need to also go ahead and be able to make these new ingots yes each one in all the previous tiers you just had one thing that you had to do one type of kibble you had to do one type of trank you had to do not the case anymore each of these while parallel tiers um each have their own special darts and kibbles so we got to make all the special metal for each and they all take this which we only have 
1100 of which isn't a heck of a lot we're gonna have to hopefully i don't know do the best that we can with what we got um let's see for the frost fire fire is probably the one that i want to work on let's see if we can make i don't know i guess for now 50 is that going to be too much boom all right so it's going to take 300 of that and then we also need for this special forge to work we need to use fire essence so let's go ahead put in some fire essence about a boom and turn on so this is going to cook much quicker and there are the special new ingots which we are not at yet but once we are the only place that we can cook them so good to know good to know anyway let's get a whole bunch of fire ones done up first let's make some fire kibble and there's some pretty cool new fire creatures yes that i would like to go after today so let's do our best Ooh, but uh yes wish me luck guys i'll finish making up with the kibble everything and let's go on the hunt Ooh, and just to show you i am definitely opting towards making the hives immediately very very important because these bees they're just a pain in the butt they get in your way and it also crafts much slower so all three hives are made and i've got the space form right here so let me get them put in place all right we have 50 of each metal made which hopefully should be enough to make all the darts we could want um let's go ahead and first i think i want to go after a fire guy first um we need to make fire narcotics all right so to make this let's just see some more fire blood um all right let's try that see if that will be enough in fact i think they go in multiples of three it said let me just see again darts no four oh that should be enough and we'll have a little bit left over all right fair enough let's go ahead and do we have enough for that or is it going to be 24 all right that might be enough that might be enough to do it um we're a little bit short more but you know we'll try that we'll try that to start i think it will be good um next is the kibble all right so um we do have the rest of our honey hopefully made up yes we do electric frost and fire beautiful all right let's go ahead just because it's not always even amounts let's toss it into here our different honeys and we can just pull what we want just making sure that looks keeps looking like it's electric to me so kibbles now now we let all of our stuff sit overnight so we should be good um can i grab enough for let's say 25 kibble hopefully that's enough for anything we want to tame more than enough beautiful all right i think we're good to go let's just see how much fire blood do we have left Oh, we got tons. We're fine. You know what? I'm going to make up uh, more darts, too. Let's go ahead and make another, another 50 here. Boom. Got our kibble. Awesome. Let me see if I can make a little bit more kibble, too. I'm just getting a little worried. Um, Let's make five more. Um kibble and five more beautiful awesome all right and the last starts perfect all right 50 darts now that's definitely gonna be enough oh heck yeah all right um let's leave one kibble back here in case we need to refresh it and let's go out on the hunt guys wish me luck and let's grab you to go with me for taming and i think that should be good awesome all right let's see what we can find holy crap go away go away leave me alone all right 
I just came across something that looks pretty cool. Let's put this on. Whoa, 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 whoa. Come on, raptors. Get the crap out of here. All right, can we get our dire bear out in time? Come on. And get wrecked. Stupid raptors. Don't even know what they're doing. All right, so fire guys are a little scary. Um, They do quite a bit of damage over time. So we are going to have to, you know, do our best to deal with it. Let's go ahead and dump all this. All right. So let's see if we can find him. I was flying over at like super fast speeds. Where'd you go, bros? Don't know if they fell down or not. So we are up. Oh, I think that I think that's it right there. Oh, I think we do a little bit better on level. I did see more than one. So let's just see how we do. Fire Lion, Alpha Ravager. All right, let's pop down here and take these guys out. Get wrecked. All right, cool. Scorpions are pretty neat too. All right, let's get these guys out of the way. All right, doing pretty good. Prime Saber, look at that. All right, come here, RG, you gotta go. All right, come on, where are the other ones? I saw like a pride of lions all together. Where are they? Is that a lion? Nope, Dodic. All right, let's peek over on this side. Lions! Where the crap did you go? All right, let me hunt them down. Ugh. Thirsty, thirsty. Let me hunt them down. We'll be right back in less. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, crappy lion. What else is over here? Saber tooth. Oh, <gasps> I knew I saw a good one. Yes, that is 100% the one. Oh, heck yes. All right, so this is going to be what we do. Let's pop down here. Yeah. All right, and let's go to, oh, 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 did I, I didn't load my darts yet. My goodness, I'm just not prepared at all. All right, come on. Paying attention to my health. I really wish that the health potions would work from your hot bar. It would make life so much easier. All right. Look at him draining my stamina too. What the crap? All right, not quite as scary as in the past when we've uh, done taken on these guys. I think that's just because we're a prime, our resistance. But this is beautiful and not a heck of a lot of kibble. It should be easily enough for us to tame two of them. All right, let's go, bro. It would be great if I didn't even have to use a health potion. All right, that's it, that's it. Be stupid, be stupid, stay right there. Oh, this is the perfect spot to tame. Come on! So close. Yeah! All right. Looking pretty clear. Jeez, is it them that's making me so thirsty? I think it might be. You know, there was something. There was a big update in Supreme. Um, I'm starting to wonder. I think it had to do with this. They might be able to damage us through the mount a little. Yeah. Holy crap. Look at, look at it. It's doing damage to us. Five... Minus one, and no, wrong thing. Starve out. Holy crap. I got to drink a health potion myself. All right, I think it's going to be better to tame from one of these guys. Epic. We got our first lion, guys. Oh, it is so cool. Holy crap. All right, we're going to need to make a saddle for it, of course. So I guess let's go. I don't know. I don't know if I want to take the chance. That's a 600 one. The chance of possibly losing it. Let me see if I can find any other lower level lions that we need to get a male. And then we can breed them. Ooh, a couple things that I just noticed. Um, Check this out, guys. Uh, We got a, a new charm. 
yeah, it's called a lucky fire charm. This is new in the update and it says the RNG. OK, so you get a fire charm will protect you against fire auras can be fused into the supreme elemental charm. That's pretty cool. And then we also got a jump charm. Not sure if this is new. I haven't seen it before, though, but it says you can now jump really high and take no fall damage. That's pretty epic. You know what? That would probably go perfect with the glider wings from this mod. Yeah, we still have to try that out. Um, anyway, uh, we've got the fire charm, so we're not going to take damage, at least the aura damage from the fire guys anymore. Oh, my goodness. Where'd he go? He was just right here. Oh, crap. This might be really bad. Oh, this might be really bad. Um, let's hop on to our dire. What the crap? Oh, no. Where? Oh, oh, oh. There we go. Look, look, look. All right. Oh, it's going to be two hits. That's it. Yeah. All right. Awesome. I'm kind of scared. All right. I couldn't remember if this dire bear did damage when it moved. Let's get rid of that, dude. And how many kibble? Good. Just two. All right. One, a two, and starve out. Beautiful. Awesome. All right, guys. We got a crappy lion and a good lion. Let's breed them to make a really, really epic and awesome god lion. All right, let's get our two new lions out. Lion and lioness. Do they have the same skin or are there, is there a male and female look? All right, it looks like it's the same exact skin. That's fine. This is the cool looking one anyway. And enable mating and... Ooh, I just realized they are probably gestation ones. Let's turn this on. Enable gestation eggs. All right. And behavior enable mating. Beautiful. All right. And we should get a nice lion egg to pop out. Come on, come on. Almost there. And let's go. All right. Let's wait for the egg to be ready to hatch. And yeah, then we can start the real breeding. All right. It is that time. Let's go ahead and hatch out our new lions. I am super excited about this. What are they going to look like? Lion babies. Come on. Yes. Oh, they're so cute. Holy crap. And they also, uh, they put me on fire. Fire charm, quick, quick. Holy crap. Look at the little baby faces. They're adorable. Holy cow. Just look at them all. Wow. And look at, we got a mutation on one of them. Pretty sick. I have a feeling it's just because we didn't imprint them. I think once, hopefully... Hopefully, I don't always have to wear the fire charm. Let's look at what they look like once they're fully grown. All right. Awesome. And I did best eggs with them, so they are all the uh, very best possible, except for it looks like I said, like I said, we got a mutation on one of them. Wow. The fire lion army. We, I think we might have got some twins. Holy crap. That's a lot. Yeah, we definitely got some twins. Oh, my goodness. We definitely 100% got maybe even triplets. Dude, they're so sick. All right, let's take off her charm. I want to see if they do fire to me. If they're okay, if I own them, it doesn't look like they do fire. It was just because we didn't imprint on them yet. And they were still, I guess, technically babies are kind of like wild. All right, awesome. Let's now start to improve the stats. We have a 132 in the melee which and 133 in the health, which on its own is not bad, but we can get it a lot better. So let me do my magic. All right, several hours have passed. I've been breeding like a madman. And uh, yeah, we're at our final, final one. Oh, 
If we can just get one of these to work out, we'll be all set. And I think we will. We have a good chance of it. So prepare for breeding. We're using the propagator. We just need one more mutation in the melee. And we are totally two statted. All right. We got a lot here. I, I did a real lot just so that we'd have better probability. Start breeding. View progress. All right. So we got to chill for a moment. All right, they are mating. And boom. All right. So, nope. Yes, we got one. We got. Come on, come on. Come on, come on. Two. And. All right, we got two. That's good enough for me. Oh, my Lord. Hey, this is epic, guys. All right. So, I'm just going to uh, throw them through again, switch the gender on one of them, and um, they're both exactly, exactly the same. So, we'll be able to make the Fire Lion Army. Let me get that all set, all the backups, and then let's go take our very first ride. What a day! All right, get ready for the Fire Lion Army. Let's toss out all the eggs and let's watch them hatch. Let's go. Nice. All right, we definitely got some twins and, and extra hatches in there. Wow. All right, so which one do we want to take? Um trying to see if we got any mute that one's mutate there's a couple of mutated color ones but i didn't notice when i actually would throw them out they pretty much always looked the same so this i don't know all right why don't we just grab this one for now looks good enough for me next question we do not have a saddle what is a lion saddle cost all right and Oh, it, it, these cost metal ingots now. The special infused one. Luckily, we have a few extras. So we can actually, why don't we make enough for a pair of them? Yes. All right. So let's grab one more lion. I'm going to level two of them up then. Um, Let's see. You, you. All right. Looks good enough to me. All right. Our two lions. All right. Let's go. Bada boom and bada boom. Awesome. So stat wise, we are looking at 254 in the melee. And then because it was an odd number, 253 in the health. But that is pretty substantial. All right, sweet. Let's give you a saddle. And let's give you a saddle. Awesome. Very nice. All right. We'll probably want to color up the saddles since they're like special creatures. You know, they've got it's a custom saddle look. Of course, they're based off of sabers. I just don't know if they're stronger than sabers. We'll just have to find out. All right. Let's put these on them. Beautiful. And bada boom, bada boom. Let's refresh them. And let's go. Fire lion bit. Whoa. Dude, this guy is fast. It's like super fast. Holy crap. All right, let's go. Uh, do I have the special charm? All right, I have fire charm. We got to get all the different charms. We get that from defeating different elementals. So again, that was just added. So that's why we don't really have any yet. Come on. Wow, 222,000. Not bad. Plus, we get the extra fire damage. Look at that. Just to stuff in the area, we do fire damage. That is super sick. All right. Um, right. Let's go ahead and get one of these on them. Let's start to boost them up. Yeah, this is pretty sick. So just residual fire damage to anything. We don't even have to hit stuff. We just got to get close to him. Let's go try this. Look at that. It's not like crazy amount of damage. We'll see if that goes up more. But, you know, it's something. It is absolutely something. All right. Got another fire guy here. 
Get wrecked. Lucky charm of crafting we just got. So we got to get all the different charms. And once we get all the elemental ones, we should be able to then make one that works for all of them. Ooh. I did a lot, even though it's not showing up. Well, I guess they it's a prime. It's got a lot of health. Let's just see. Let's get close to this guy. Okay. It was probably my attack that showed up for that much. I was going to say, if the fire damage is doing that much, that's insane. Very, very cool fact. I like it. All right. Let's continue to level up. So I think I'm going to go in this one, max attack, and then we'll put 49 levels into the health, which that's basically the remainder we have after we get to 255. All right, so 49, beautiful. Get it all pumped in. I like to do it all at once just so we only have to use one health potion. Awesome. Bada boom. All right, get healed up. I, I used the healing one, right? I hope I did. Yeah, we definitely did. Get out of here, you flying squirrel. Awesome. All right, we got to find... There's a lot of fire guys over here. What we are really low on is electric stuff, so we got to spend some time looking for that. By the way, can I shoot? Yep, I can shoot off of them. Dude, this thing is so sick. Now, it might not be, like, extremely powerful compared to, like, say, a Prime. Prime's already really strong, so I'm not necessarily expecting... To get something that's gonna it, it might hit for a lot more but this i just do not know it also might be about the same and this is looking like it's pretty on board with what like a saber tooth would be so i was hoping for a little more power let me see oh <gasps> it's got us it's got a right click too hold on oh i think that does a lot more or the exact same Either way, it's pretty sick. All right. So eight, yeah, I think it's the exact same. Ah, oh, I was hoping it would be the even more powerful move. It's still cool to have. All right. I'm going to have to look up. It would be so sick if this was more like a Thyla and could climb. And was of the power of a Thyla. All right, let's just see here. I can't. Yeah, I, it's it's a saber. It's a saber. But, ooh! Yes! Very nice. Now, uh, I will also have to compare the healths. We've got sabers that I, I made. Remember we made? I'm pretty sure I bred the saber-tooth army. Pretty sure. Isn't it funny how much I forget after a day? We'll have to go compare to see what the stats look like. It's awesome, though. All right, so we already got to max, right? Yeah, we got to max. I got to move on to the next one and level that one up. Then we'll go and we'll compare it to the Sabertooth. All right, we have finished leveling up our first pair. Not bad. Let's just go ahead, pump in the final levels. Awesome. And both of them, 255 in the melee, 49 in the health. Now, I wanted to see in comparison to the saber. Oh, yeah, that is sub. Wait. Oh, that saber isn't leveled up. Let me see if I have a leveled saber. Holds the phone. Holds the phone. All right, so these were our best creatures. Did I level one? Yes, this one I leveled. All right, let's go check it out compared to this one. Now, the sabers, I did not uh, fully uh, breed them out as far as I did with this one. We weren't quite as rich as we were are now, but yeah, substantial difference. Even with the difference, 28 million. That's a lot. Not quite as much. Well, 28 million, that's about the same as with a, a dire bear with the same, you know, 49 into it. 28 million. Yeah. So that's a substantial difference. Let's see damage-wise again. I feel like the sabers were hitting for more, though. That's what that's what kind of bugs me, you know? All right, so let's grab all these guys. Like, I feel, I don't know.
I'm trying to understand how the tiers work. You'd think that they'd be not only stronger on top of getting the extra damage, but you'd also think a lot. I don't know. Would a lion be stronger than a tiger? I kind of feel like because it's a special creature, it should be, but it's also a tier above. All right, let's see. Oh, crap. No, it's 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 pretty much the same. Pretty much the same. One... 1.18 mil. Let's go try the other one. And which which leads you to wonder. All right, that's the saber. That's the line. Which leads you to wonder what if they're the same. Would a elemental one of these guys hit for the same as a prime? Yeah, look at that, 1.18. It's almost identical. You know, which would make sense if it's basically just a reskin saber with an extra move. But I don't know. I guess you, I don't know. Do you not get extra power with the elemental tier? This is interesting. Now, the other thing this tells me though, if that's the case, the next boss might not I wonder how much of a uh, jump in power it is. I heard it got a lot harder. I heard it got a real lot harder. Um, let me see. And we also do have rider defense on this guy. But I definitely, I like our new guy. Um, let's grab out the other lion and give ourselves a uh, mate boost now. Follow me. And let's find out with mate boost, what are we going to hit for? 1.5. 1.5 not bad not a huge jump but you know a couple hundred thousand it's not bad but if you have a pack of these all of them i i wonder if it's gonna have you know um fire damage that stacks that could be extremely powerful now that i think about it let's go see if we can find out come on let's find something we can do fire to all right right here is it stacking fire damage? I can't really tell. It doesn't look like it's stacking, but that would be so epic if it did. It probably resets possibly a little bit faster. Possibly, but yeah, it doesn't look like we have stacking. But all in all, it's an epic creature. It is quick. It is super quick. It is super fun. And I love seeing fun new things. But anyway, yeah, it's been pretty epic. We're definitely not taking on any uh, bosses yet. We have to go through, just like we did with the last here, find out what our very best things are going to be. And this next boss is no slouch. We need creatures, I believe, from every single type of element group to be able to take it on. So I don't know. I'm kind of curious. I wonder if it's like in stages or or what. This I don't know, but we will eventually find out once we get to it. Anyway, yep, it's that time. Let me go through those comments. All right, guys, I just finished going through the comments and yes, it is now that time. That's right. Time to name the dinos. For those of you that do not know, at the end of every single episode, episode i go through the comments of the previous episode and i pick out all the most awesomest name suggestions that you guys leave in the down there that's right just remember if you want to have a chance of getting your name chosen you got to be a subscriber so smash that subscribe button and yeah just comment down below it just that easy Anyway, for today, we've got the Dire Bears to name. I decided to pick out my favorite four mutated bears, and these will be the ones that are getting named. We have... Blue Bear. Love it. We have Yogi. We have Goldie and Yellow Jacket. Epic names, guys. Seriously, epic names. Thank you so very much. Um, For next time, we need names for our new Fire Lion Army. So for sure, at least these two. But if I get more names, I'll name even more because we got 
a ton with all the exact same max stats. So pretty dang sweet. But anyway, guys, thank you so very much for watching. It's been a pleasure, as you always do. Please remember to show that amazing support for the series by smashing that thumbs up button. If you're new to the channel or you haven't yet, please do not forget to subscribe to the Daily Arc Awesomeness. And as always, guys, I'll see you tomorrow. Thanks again and peace out.